a look from our Viero camera that's down on the Spring Fire. This camera is actually located in the Sangre de Cristo Mountains, looking back down toward the southwest. And this is just a 45 minute loop of the smoke billowing off of that fire. And the dark smoke really indicates that that's a very active and fast changing fire. And then watch right here. You'll start to see some of the smoke develop up in Grand County this afternoon. Right in there, you see some of the smoke from the Grand County fire visible from our camera that is out at City Park in Denver. So. Man, we need some cool weather and some rain. 105 today, not only beating the old record of 99, but it ties the all-time record for any day in Denver. 63 was the low right now. Temperature 100 out at the airport, 95 downtown, 7% relative humidity with a gusty south-southeast wind. But look at this, 71 degrees up at Billings. There's a front up that way, and cooler air is going to arrive here for the weekend, replacing the very hot conditions that we currently have. For tonight, just some high clouds around except there may be a few isolated gusty storms out of the plains this evening. They will not amount to much. They'll last till about maybe 9 o'clock to midnight and then die away. Dry, mild conditions overnight with just a little bit of cloud cover out on the eastern plains by daybreak. Low will be 63 in Denver, 66 at Akron, 73 down at La Junta, 41 up in Leadville. Along the Front Range, mainly 50s tonight in the mountain towns and low to mid 60s expected on the plains. Nice morning tomorrow. We'll start out mild. Temperatures comfortable enough, but already warm and breezy by 9 a.m. By the time we get to noon, it's hot and dry again. However, later in the afternoon, although the fi high fire danger continues tomorrow, there will be some isolated storms. And look at this. That cold front starts to approach the state, bringing relief from the heat and a little bit of rain by the time we head to the weekend. Tomorrow, 83 up at Steamboat, 82 at Laramie, 95 in Denver, triple digits down to the southeast, Pueblo, La Junta, Lamar. Most of the readings will be in the mid-90s, a few upper 90s tomorrow expected along the I-25 corridor, mid-90s out on the eastern plains, a mix of 70s and 80s up into the mountains. Forecast for tonight, a few gusty storms on the plains early, clearing warm, 63 for a low. Tomorrow, the high temperature not as bad at 95. You know, it's hot when you say 95 is a whole lot better. Few storms possible in the afternoon. This one to break it down 67 at 7 a.m., 88 by noon, and 95 degrees by 4 o'clock. But watch this on Saturday. We start out dry in the morning. As that colder air begins to come in, there's more moisture coming in, so we get some possibly some strong thunderstorms in the afternoon on Saturday, and the temperatures really drop off. 95 tomorrow, 83 on Saturday with the storms, 87 with a few storms on Sunday, back to hot Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday with 90s, and just a slight chance of some storms coming up on Wednesday. So at least we break this uh, feverish forecast a little and uh, might get some decent rains on Saturday.